Since the end of 2017, the National Cervical Screening Program has formally upgraded. Now, we actually look for the presence of an HPV virus as well. The HPV virus is a very common skin virus that's associated with warts. It is so common, in fact, that it's considered as a normal part of being sexually active. Certain strains of the HPV can cause cells on the cervix to change into cancer. But the good news is this is a very slow progress. It can take years, even decades, for cells to turn into cancer. So we have plenty of time to catch them before that happens. There are more than 100 strains of HPV out there. Some are associated with benign warty lesions and some are associated with more nasty cervical cancers. The screening program is designed to screen for the more higher risk strains of the HPV virus that are associated with the cervical cancer. We know that more than 99% of cervical cancers are associated with the HPV virus. And this is why we focus our screening program now on detecting the high risk strains of this virus. The good news is that the HPV virus is usually cleared by your own immune system within two to three years average. To try and help your body clear the virus uh, sooner rather than later, we should live clean and live healthy and try to avoid smoking as that can suppress our immune system and uh, delay the clearance of HPV from our system.